is Leono again. Welcome back and thank you for being on vacations connected to my videos. So, kid, you know, sometimes I don't read the Bible because I think this is a very heavy job. And reading the Bible is reading one, two, three, and many pages. And sometimes it's so hard for me. Do you think that it's good or it's not? So today I have a friend and she's gonna explain me how to read the Bible in a better way. Okay, come here. Hello. What is your name? Hello, my name is Allison. Allison. Yes, I read the Bible oh. every day. Oh, listen. I know the Bible is a big book, but it's okay to read just a little at a time every day. Think about it. These are God's words to us. Oh. If God wrote a book, wouldn't you want to read it? That's what the Bible is. They're God's words to us. They tell us who God is. They tell us who Jesus is. They tell His words tell us how He wants us to live. And they tell us how to treat each other. That's very, very important. So one of my favorite things to do when I wake up in the morning is I read my Bible first. In the morning, wow. In those words, I find what I need for the rest of the day. I like what she said. You listen in the morning. Sometimes we just read the Bible on Sundays. Oh no! You think what we can do? You could only eat food for your body on oh, Sunday. It's correct. You need to eat food every day for your body to be healthy. So you need to read God's word every day for your heart to be healthy. Oh, thank you. And, you know, Reading the Bible is something that's gonna help my kids about reading in Spanish too, right? Yes. Wow. Absolutely. Yeah, you can read the Bible and you can read the Bible as you're reading a book and you're getting new ideas and you're learning about Jesus. Wow, it's amazing what you said. Thank you so much for that message. Um, do you think how can the parents help the kids? About reading the Bible. One of my favorite things to do with my two daughters when they were little is to read to them. And then when they got bigger, I asked them to read to me. And it's a special time between the two of us because we are reading God's Word together. And that teaches them to love God's Word too. Wow, reading together. Listen, parents, live reading together. Don't let your kids alone. Okay, so. I really love what you have to say. Thank you so much. And kids, hello again, okay? See you later. Bye.